Hey guys, today I will be installing PEF Sense on this Liner 7525 router. I will be downloading and prepping this USB key with the installation files. Alright, let's go to the uh, PEF Sense download site. The file type will be install. The architecture will be AMD64. The platform will be USB Memstick. And the console will be serial. We don't have any kind of display port on this specific hardware. And let's hit download. The file has downloaded, but it's in a compressed format. So I'm going to use 7-zip to uncompress it. Let's just uncompress it to the current download folder. This .img file is what we're going to end up writing to the USB key. And let's close down 7-zip. We won't need this any further. Okay, let's launch uh, Win32 Disk Imager and select our image file from the download folder. And this is the image file that we need. And we're going to be writing this to the M drive, which is our USB key. Let's hit write. And yes, we want to continue. The write is complete, so we can close down this program as well. Let's eject the USB key and insert that into the router. I'm currently in the Lanner BIOS setup, and from here I can set up a temporary boot device, which I will select the USB key. And I will let the system boot with the defaults. Accept these settings. Let's choose quick, easy install and confirm. And we are going to choose the embedded kernel. We will restart the router now and once it comes back, we will log into the web configurator. And we are back. Uh, let's jump to Chrome and log into the PFSense web configurator. I'm going to log in with uh, admin and PFSense as the password. I'm going to accept all the defaults and use the Google DNS servers. And that's the complete installation of PFSense on the Lanner 7525 router. 